Okay, I'm going to scrap it right now. Um, I have one inspection apartment building just taking three samples on they're just expanding a wall and something like that, but probably won't film that. But anyways, uh this what I have here is uh some cast here. There might be some cast mixed in here, it's aluminum, but sometimes it's it's old sheet, bicycle rims. But anyways, that's my load here. I'm thinking maybe um 150 pounds, I'm thinking. Hope, hoping anyways. So we'll see. Stay tuned. Your metal on the road here. door here it's a commercial door it's like okay so what kind of crap people throw away what you find Okay, here's this, all this is from this one guy here. He's dragging all this junk. That's why the bylaws, you know, when you see all this, they throw it all in the garbage, but crazy. I feel bad for the guy, but what are you gonna do? It can't be normal to drag that much crap around. That's worthless. Anyways, too bad, sad to see that, but it's, what's going on okay so uh basically um that that load i found on the ground um you know i just picked up just a few minutes ago I, there's a few things that are steel in the back here but it ended up being like uh 55 pounds of dirty aluminum it had, it had nails and things different things it looks like they're open today actually somewhat open i think they're not really open they're just taking a few guys only okay so basically 15 cents a pound they gave me for that dirty stuff. I mean, I could have cleaned some of it, but I said, ah, forget it. I don't want to deal with it. I found the side of the road. It was $8.25. That's that load. The load that uh, I took in, I had a total of, uh, well, it was 132, 105 dirty, they said. They called dirty, we had a couple of rubber seals, and they called that dirty. Wow, that's so stupid, huh? Anyways, that's what I say. That's how picky they are now. Well, they, these guys are picky, anyways. Now the yard's closed, they don't seem to care about the, the odd little tiny thing. So minute little seal around uh, the a cylinder head that was um, on the pressure washer right to the brass off the other day. So it ended up being 137 pounds total. I thought it was a little more, but anyways, came to uh, 61 dollars, you know, 81 dollars and 50 cents. 81 or 61 anyways um it's kind of how it goes uh what do, what do you do right prices suck you know that's what it is but uh what did come out of, as a pound yeah i think it was 61 dollars um it was uh 48 cents a pound dropped down a couple cents from yesterday or two days ago whenever last time I went maybe yesterday actually um, and it was 15 cents for dirty so um, that's what I say if you don't clean anything up at this yard 
to give you a really really bad price even though it's fairly clean you know I, like I took every piece of screw you seen yesterday I, I made sure there's no stainless steel mixed in there you know because you never know right any of that looks suspicious I took it off so anyways that's it I gotta do an inspection right now only taking three samples off a partition wall they want to take out on a on a job they're gonna renovate apartments okay probably no video there I don't think but you never know we'll see okay stay tuned little bikes here say free kids bikes we don't need the helmets but uh Someone else could use the helmets. Is that an umbrella? It's an umbrella. It's a bling on there. Speeder bikes. Move some stuff on there. Okay. Let's block over another bike. Directly one block over. That was the bike on this side and this is the bike here. Basically, how you find one is the block over. There's another one, just like that. Metal here. Just metal, like from a roasting pan. Okay, looks like a day of bikes today. Two more bikes. I like bikes, they're heavy. Got weight. This one. More aluminum wheels. Always dump, people dump stuff always in this spot here. All the time. Some sort of espresso kind of machine. It'll probably be it's pretty heavy for its size. I'll go grab it. A couple adapters. Uh, make sure you wear gloves guys always use gloves on whatever you touch nowadays you don't know they say the virus could last i don't know 17 days on a cruise ship it lasted they said they were getting uh well, i guess when they decontaminated and they went through the ship and then swabbed everything and they found it lasted i think 17 days so it's crazy but I hear different stories. People keep changing the stories. Three hours on this, five hours, two days, one day. The screen there. It's brand new, actually. Totally brand new. Okay. Just keep moving here. 
Better to have two gloves on, right? Anyways, can't get too paranoid, right? Just kind of make sure. I have the Clorox wipes here too. Have them there handy. Especially if I'm, you know, eating my lunch or something or touching my face or something like, you know. Okay, no uh, auto parts. Oh, yes, auto parts. My guy, right on. Never fails my guy. Awesome. Little parts guy. Ooh, nice and heavy. Never fails. That's why I took a detour this way actually. Hundred pounds HMS. Okay.